Hello. Welcome home. Okay, that was take one, about to take two, but I need to really remember like what this is about. Like, I've carried this on my chest for so long and I'm really ready to finally let it go. And this is my process. This is how I let it go. This is how I've faced this heartbreak and the disappointment of a love that I lost that was never mine. But at the time, I couldn't see. I just, I didn't understand. And now that I do, it's just so cathartic for me to get this off my chest and express this in, like, the best way I know how. I wasn't really able to talk about what I went through in my relationship and all my personal stuff. But I was able to write through it and sing through it and I have to center myself in that as I record it and remember that like there was a time when I didn't know that I have to love myself first and no one is worth more than my happiness and my peace and I can't love somebody else more than I love myself and be so scared of being lonely that I'm willing to settle for less and settle for mistreatment when I know that I deserve better. There was a time when I didn't understand that and I have to go back to that. You know, you know, I have to get back to that place to really get the, the meaning of the song out, the feeling, the, the emotion that's like packed in the lyrics. Because everything I said is from the heart and it might be hard to hear, especially for the person this is about, but I'm just really glad that I was able to come to this realization that I do have to love me myself and I, and no one is going to love me the way I can love myself, especially when I prioritize that and I put that first, you know? So that's what this song is about. And I have to communicate that in my voice. So that's just what I'm getting out. See, this is independent life because I have to start and stop and sing, do it all by myself. So it's a challenge, but it's kind of fun. It's kind of fun, I'm not gonna lie. Okay. Mm -hmm. 